Hello my beautiful MK Love Fam, welcome back to another episode. If you're new here, my name is Mel and I'm here to help you break the cycle of abuse. Now talking about abuse, what the flip is going on with the world right now? Holy heck, we are experiencing a massive shift in consciousness, a massive rebirth of humanity. And in between, we're in the gray area where we have a lot of our rights have been taken away, um, which is, that is another topic for itself. We need to focus on what we can control, which is ourselves. That is making sure that we are in a higher vibrational state. We are vibrating on the frequency of love. If you can, if you have time right now, that is your asset. Use it to your advantage. Make yourself a priority. And more importantly, make your healing your number one priority during this time. Now, I was journaling the other morning and my beautiful angels told me that the way that I can help this beautiful MK Love fam, you watching this right now, heal collectively is to join together with an online women's moon circle, which is kind of crazy to me because I thought I was going to be doing these in person in Adelaide. Um, I thought it'd be a fabulous way to meet new people, but apparently my angels have another situation lined up for us, which is to do this online via Zoom. I'll be on video call, you'll be on video call. You can join on your on your laptop in your pajamas in your bed. I really don't care. I want to see your beautiful face. You don't have to talk if you don't feel comfortable. That's completely up to you. But I thought we'll use the 60 minutes to join together just after the full moon. We do it at the same time that these YouTube videos are scheduled. I'll link all the details for you below so you can figure out the time zones. And I thought it'd be a fabulous way to join collectively together to heal. Heal in sync with Mama Moon. Mama Moon is going into the full moon in Libra. Let me check my calendar. On the 8th of April. So that will probably be the 7th of April for most of you in the Northern Hemisphere. So this is an amazing time where we can focus on what we can control. Now, Libra is actually the sign of balance. It's literally the scales. It's shown as a picture of the scales in the astrology. So this is finding our balance. You know, six months ago when we had the new moon in Libra, our life looked completely different. So now we're trying to adjust and to keep up with where we're at and trying to find our new balance. So I thought this would be a beautiful time to gather together. I was thinking in this moon circle that we can do a guided meditation, we can do some journaling, we can literally burn our, our piece of paper, whatever we wanted to release, to signify it as a beautiful ceremony, to release that and no longer serves us. And it no longer has that, that cord attached to us. Then we'll be able to do a weekly, well, not a weekly, a monthly tarot reading for the next month to figure out what's the focus for the next month. And more importantly, what do we need to focus on improving for each single week? So there'll be one card for the month and four cards for each of the weeks. So five cards in general, but who knows? There could be more cards that the angels give me, but that's kind of where I'm at right now. So if this floats your boat and this is something that you would love to be a part of, it's $11 and 11 cents. That's Australian dollars, by the way. So you can do the conversions. And I think it would be a really fabulous opportunity to gather together. I'm going to use this as a test to see if we have enough interest. Um, if we do have enough interest, maybe this is going to be a monthly occurrence. It's kind of going to give you a little glimpse into what I do with my coaching clients. And if you're at the stage where you haven't really released anything ever, this could be really emotional time for you. If you're someone who is working with all the phases of the moon and each full moon, you make yourself a priority to release and you have your own little full moon ceremony. However, this looks truly best for you, then that's going to be wonderful as well. So it's really for anyone who is willing, willing, willing to make yourself a priority and to heal what doesn't serve you, whether that be a relationship. Well, Libra actually rules relationships. So that's quite interesting that we're talking about this now as I'm going into specializing in healing toxic relationships. So it's completely up to you. I would love to invite you to join. And if you want to know more, all you have to do is click the link below to check out that delicious goodness. And if that does align, holy flippin' heck, I would love to see your beautiful face. And yeah, I think that's all I have to say. Have an amazing day. 
wherever you are in the world. I know that sounds like, oh, have an amazing day with all this crazy shit going on, but it's like, no, you can have fun in your own home, in your little bubble, no matter what is going on. You have the power to choose higher vibrational thoughts. If you're struggling to do this by yourself, then this is the perfect time to join together. Maybe it's gonna give you that little Kickstarter to ignite. Um, and I'm hearing, um, we're part of something way bigger. Bigger than you, bigger than me, bigger than the pictures that framed us to see. Legacy, oh. We're part of something way bigger. Bigger by Beyonce, that's coming up. Yeah, we're a part of something bigger. We're ascending to the next level of consciousness. And in this, oh, it's a little crazy. So if you need some help, you'd love some guidance, totally check that out. I will link it for you. It's literally this week. <laughs> Anyways, my love, thank you so much for watching if you made it to the end of today's video. And I will see you hopefully for our first women's full moon circle. I love you, I love you, I love you. Goodbye.